Hello students, welcome back to the class. In the previous learning experience, we have learned about the respiratory system. We have also learned about the characteristics of the respiratory surface. Do well to go back to the session up should you have any concern over that session. In this particular session, students, we are going to be talking about the respiratory mechanism. You must have been wondering, how does various animals, various organisms carry out respiration? It is important for us to learn different organisms, starting from the unicellular organisms, then we go to advanced organisms and even the plants. The first we are going to be talking about today, we are going to be looking at amoeba. Number A is amoeba. Now, you all know what an amoeba is. Or should you don't know, you can look at the image already in this video. The amoeba is a unicellular organism. Now for this amoeba, respiration happens across the entire body surface. So there is no specific organ for respiration, but respiration happens in amoeba across the entire body surface through simple diffusion. Hence, there is oxygen in the water, tends to diffuse into the body of the amoeba, and then the carbon four oxide also diffuse out through the body of the amoeba into back into the environment. Now, we need to understand that all these processes happen across the entire body system. That is to say, every part of the amoeba, all across, all across the body surface, respiration tends to occur. Thank you, class.